What's up, A gang? We are back at it again with another freaking weekly vlog. It is Monday. It's like noon. And although I've been up for a little minute, not that long. Don't get too excited. I'm coming. <sighs> oh, this is rushing me. So the people are here so that we can pick out our stuff for our um house y'all remember our house had got hit by the hailstorm the real bad hailstorm so now we have to get my lens is crusty dusty that's better now we have to get a new roof new windows new siding um gutters little stuff like that so they are here so we can pick them out some police told me last minute so i wasn't ready so now i'm just trying to pull myself together so i ain't looking like a crackhead this should do. I just got a Nike top on, some Lululemon leggings, nothing fancy smancy. I ain't going nowhere, at least not right now. Um, so, yeah, let's get this vlog started. I don't rush through that damn intro for no reason. They're not even ready for me yet. They're not talking numbers and stuff, and I don't participate in those type of conversations. I don't know nothing about no numbers and what's supposed to be what, what's supposed to be. Yeah, ignore the fact that it look like the paint is peeling in my bathroom. As y'all know, we have not renovated the bathroom yet. So, I have not repainted nothing. I have not done the re the, redone the floors. We're actually planning on turning this whole bathroom out and starting over. Um, problem is, is that we have other projects that's taking priority over the bathroom. So, yeah, just in case somebody decided to want to come and say something about Because y'all be paying attention to the wrong stuff. I have learned that about the social media. It's that y'all be paying attention to the background and stuff. And it's always somebody that want to be funny. That want to point out some shit that they don't need to be pointing out. So, before before y'all decide that y'all want to be funny, I'm going to point it out for you. There, it's chipping. Why? We ain't painted nothing in here yet, okay? Matter of fact, let me just adjust... We're going to adjust the camera so that y'all don't even see it. So anyway, I'm going to finish doing my little morning routine, even though it's not morning anymore. I need to like touch up my locks in the front, but I don't have anything special going on. So yeah, I'm brushing them because they frizzy. So I'm brushing the frizz out a little bit. So anyway, um, I think I'm going to the gym today. Hopefully. I don't know. Lexi's little friend guy is coming over so that he can get his hair done. I'm just wondering, is he not tired of being her test dummy yet? This would be the third time or fourth time, probably third time that she's done his hair. And it looks good. Don't get me wrong. She's done her thing for her to be a beginner, but he ain't sick of her using him as her test dummy. Um, who am I? Who am I to judge? So yeah, we are just winging it today because I don't have any concrete plans. I just need to pick out this roofing and my main concern is the roof and the window. So what, okay, follow me right quick, follow me. So I'm thinking black roof, black um, gutters, black windows. Problem is, is that I'm not sure because black windows cost more than white windows. I don't know if y'all knew that. I found out when I had got quotes for new windows on the first property that we built. And I was like, oh, let's do black. And the prices came back in black was tremendously higher. And I didn't really shop around a lot. So maybe it's not that bad in other places. But yeah, we have white windows right now. So in order for us to step up into like some black windows, it's gonna cost us more. And I'm not sure how much more it's gonna cost us. The insurance is paying to replace the windows as they are now. Um, apparently they are some expensive windows. They're like Anderson's or something. They like the top of the line windows that they cover, 
which is a good thing. And I noticed y'all, the person who built this house that we in, he did not go cheap on a lot of stuff. Some stuff, it was a little questionable, but a lot of stuff he did not go cheap on. So like the fixtures, like the, um, the light fixtures and like the plumbing stuff, like the hardware for the plumbing, y'all, the shit that he put in here was so expensive and they didn't make it no more. But in order to get like parts or like replacements for them, it was going to cost us too much money. So we had changed some of that shit out. The stuff that we didn't did already, we can change that stuff out to like regular stuff. So anyway, so I want black windows, black roof, black gutters. The siding, we got to figure out about the siding because the siding is only messed up in certain parts of the house. And in order for us to get siding over the whole house, the whole house not doesn't have siding. Like some, like the front of the house is brick. But the parts that have siding, in order for us to get all new siding, they have to prove, or we have to prove that the siding that's on the house, they don't make it no more. So if we do get all new siding, I think I'm going to change the color of the siding. I just ain't figured that part out yet. So anyway, let me just wait my turn until it's time for me to just pick shit out. Right now, they're talking money. So I can't help them with that, but I'll be right back. Oh, we'll be black. And then that one side will be black. And then... All I have to worry about is what I got going. This big one. Yeah, this big one chair. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just really this big one is what I really have to worry two. about. And then the two side ones, I, I think I'm going to take them out completely yeah. eventually. Don't try to say it like it was your idea. No, it, it was my idea. idea. Yeah, I'm, I'm like, why have those two little small windows? I can't so even see out the windows. The only thing I'm going to have to worry the about sunlight, is the black, is the back side. So. Okay. So. What did you say? Let's go with the granite black on the roof. So here's what it is. All right. <clears throat> so we took care of the um, roof and all that stuff. Yeah, I really got to touch up my locks up here. Because it's looking, it's looking real, real nappy. I'm going to do that. Let's do that tomorrow. We'll do that on, on video tomorrow. Um, Of me touching up my locks. Should I make a whole video for TikTok about that? about how i refresh my locks maybe i will i don't know so anyway so y'all so we got three new or that is definitely four it's not three four new orders within the last hour like i'm at the track with the fun police because he coaching i didn't know that that's where we was going so i wasn't prepared to work out so i didn't work out i was just sitting in the car um uh, waiting on them to get done and as I was sitting in the car, I kept on having orders come through. And I'm like, I love how y'all are supporting me. <laughs> Thank y'all so much because I was so scared to start this. That's why it took so many years for me to like literally put the product out there. Because I was just like, nah, they ain't going to support it. Nah, it's not people that need it. Not Like I had put so much shit in my own head that I talked myself out of putting the product out when well, i know the product worked because it literally worked on my skin this same exact product i use this product to this day i've been using it for years and that's why my skin is not broken out like it was like my skin was so bad y'all and it just happened out of nowhere somebody who never had i hope it's not like shaking when y'all watching this because my phone is literally doing this right now so i hope that when i play this back it ain't like that. If it is, I'm sorry. I apologize, but there's nothing I'm going to do about it right now. Um. So anyway, I am so happy that y'all are really supporting this new journey that I am on right now. Um, if you have not purchased yet, please just go into the link in the description of this video um, and purchase because it, it works for people with acne. Don't get me wrong. Like I, it did wonders for my acne, but you don't necessarily have to have acne to use the product because the product, it does like, it help gets rid of like blemishes that you may have. Um, it just overall gives your, your skin like a brighter, more smoother look, if that makes sense. And all of the products that I use to make, I hand make this product, which I'm gonna have to try to figure out how to make it like in a big bulk because if too many orders come through at once, I'm a little concerned on how I'm gonna handle that. 
which I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'll be fine. I, I'll hire some help or something, but I'm, yeah. We'll cross that bridge when we get there, but the products that I use to make this product, it's all natural products. It's no chemicals in here. Like there's, all this stuff is natural. Like everything in it is natural, period. One thing I will say, if you've bought the product already, or you are thinking about buying a product and you do have acne or you have acne prone skin, do not freak out if your skin starts breaking out or if it starts looking a little worse than what it's looking. Don't freak out. That was Aaliyah's problem. Aaliyah would not stay consistent with the product because every time she used it, she felt like, you know, her skin was getting worse. That is because the product is basically forcing the acne that's up under your skin. It's like speeding up the process. It's under your skin, but it's finna pop out. It just ain't popped out yet. You don't know it's there because it's under your skin. This product just forces that, like it, it forces it out quicker. So don't freak out. Your skin might get worse before it gets better. I know don't nobody wanna hear that, but every product that I have ever used for my acne has done that. Even the product that I got from the dermatologist, and when the dermatologist prescribed me the product that only worked for like six months and then my skin got used to it so it just stopped working, that's another story. I already told the story, but I'll tell it again another day. Um, she told me, your skin is gonna get worse before it gets better. So, don't use it, and it start making more pimples pop up, and you like, oh no, her product made my skin break out worse. That's, that's acne that was already there up under the skin. It was all, it was gonna come. It was gonna come one way or another. This product just sped the process up for you. It'll speed the process up and then it'll clear it up. But anyway, enough about my product. So I'm about to drop these four packages that I got within the last hour off at the, um, the post office. And then I need to stop at Walmart because we ran out of bottle waters and I need some ink for my printer, like my regular printer, not the printer that, that I use to print out labels because they don't need no ink, which I was like, that's weird. And I know it's because of the paper that it's using, like it literally don't need ink. But anyway, I need to print some other stuff off. Uh, so I need to get some ink for my printer. And then I'm making me and the fun police some teriyaki chicken the one i get from sam's i showed y'all this chicken a couple of times it come in the frozen aisle at sam's teriyaki chicken it's like teriyaki chicken breast i think or something like that don't quote me but it's teriyaki chicken it's frozen i pop them up in the oven let them cook make me a pot of white rice uh um vegetable i probably would do me some steamed broccoli or something i don't know fun please don't eat vegetables i know crazy um and then um, that's gonna be what's for dinner. Lexi went to Chipotle. Linda either gonna eat what we eating or he gonna make something else or he just gonna go get something. I don't know. Who knows? I'll make enough for him though. So, yeah. That's where we at right now and I will be back. Yeah, we got Styles by Lexi. Alright, we're done. She said book it. <laughs> she said she said book and link is so in the bio. I'm gonna leave like this at this point because <laughs> And he's just sitting there so content being the guinea pig. Yeah. He Why tr you, you trusted that? her way too Why much. I didn't agree with that. <laughs> like, I did not get forced. You didn't get forced. You had a I choice. I got forced. You had a choice. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. She eating. She kind of eating. See? Okay. I'm waiting on her to part this one out because I'm going to give her some pointers. Okay, she parting and stuff. A part of all right, mom, I don't need those. <laughs> we was everything worried, y'all. We had, we had went out and bar mannequin head and everything. She's just fine. She get it from her mama. Ain't that right? Like you say what? I said something like that. Mm. Damn. <laughs> it's not Billy. He's not talking Crawl. to you. Crawl. Come on. Crawl. Ah, ah. Damn. Down, down, Billy, Crawl. Billy, he not. Crawl. No, Billy don't understand. Down. He ain't talking to him. Down, Carol. God damn it, Billy. Billy, come here. Down, come, come sit. Sit. He not talking down. to you. Crawl, come, crawl. 
crawl, crawl, crawl. Come on. She just don't mind. Carol said, I'm finna stand up and walk. Yeah, he just don't mind. Let's go over here and teach him how to do shit because he's he slow. Yeah, Cairo a little slow. Bentley is super smart. Cairo, on the other hand, not as smart. Get all of Bentley. Yeah. Cairo, come here. some something over here. Yeah, Bentley got that one. <laughs> <laughs> Bentley's like, don't worry about it. I clean it up. Stop biting my hand. Carol, be gentle. We keep talking about this. You gotta be gentle, okay? We keep talking about being gentle. And you do the total opposite. You know your little bun falling out. Y'all look how much gray hair he got. Bro. You show sure handsome. You're so handsome. <sighs> All right, it is third Wednesday. It is Wednesday. As y'all can see, I was just at home. Some police caught himself trying to train Cairo to do some tricks like Bentley. Cairo is not as smart as Bentley. Um, apparently, from the research that I've been doing, and from just listening to other like trainers and dog owners and breeders and stuff, golden doodles are highly intelligent. So I don't want to say that Cairo is dumb, but I'm definitely going to say that Billy is extremely smart. Um, it took us months to teach him how to get paw, and that's the only thing he know how to do so far. Billy, on the other hand. It literally probably took us five minutes, and I'm not exaggerating. It probably took us five minutes to get him to give us Paul. Honestly, if I'm really being honest, every trick that we taught Bentley took him five to ten minutes to get. And I'm not exaggerating. Um, so, yeah. While he was messing with the dogs, I was editing a video yeah i really need to touch up these vlogs i really gotta do a better job um i was editing a track vlog got that posted i was gonna go to the gym earlier got up forgot that me and the phone police are sharing one car because my car is in the shop getting hail damage repaired finally i know it's been a while since that hail storm came and my car is just now getting repaired um so yeah it's like six, seven o'clock at night. And I'm just now going to the gym. Uh, I don't have anything on fancy smancy. These are some leggings from Jilly's. I think that's what it's called. I don't know. Nike t-shirt that's too small, but I'm still wearing it. And then a Nike hoodie. Um, I wish I could be the girlies on the YouTube that gets super cute to go to the gym and i'm just being honest i'm not that girl i barely get cute on a day-to-day -day basis because i never leave the house um a lot of stuff that i wear i repeat over and over and over and over again because why am i putting on a full outfit to do nothing it's just not realistic y'all i don't even know why i'm addressing this nobody nobody said anything about it I think I just got a feeling that somebody eventually gonna say something about it. I don't know. Which is kind of boring after you think about it. Because if I was watching somebody vlog every week and they wearing the same shit over and over again, I would be like, girl, can you can you mix it up for us? Anyway, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Maybe I'll I'll do a better job at putting myself together every day. But you know what? I do have an idea where I feel like I'm gonna get up and go to like the library, or maybe I'll rent like a shared space because I don't have my office anymore. I don't know if I told y'all that. I used to have my office outside of the house. I don't have, that's been gone for about a year now. No, it ain't been a whole year. I haven't used it in a year. Prior to me ending that lease, 
I think I had not been to that office in a year. That's when I knew, girl, stop paying all this money for this damn office. So now I don't have an office outside the house, but I feel like I need to get out the house every day. So I'm feeling like I want to do like a shared space, maybe library, maybe. I think the library won't be too quiet. This, I don't know. I don't know if I, I do need to be in silence to focus, but I don't know. I don't know. The library is just weird. I don't know. I can't explain it. Um, but I do think I want to start like leaving the house to work to get, you know, work done. And maybe I'll have a reason to actually put some clothes on every day. I don't know. Who knows? We'll see. So anyway, I said all of that to say that I'm about to go to the gym. And y'all know I hate going to the gym at night. But I got four months to pull my shit together before I go to Turks and Caicos. And I get it. I get it. I'm not too far gone. I'm not. But I need to pull it in just a little bit only because... I want to wear like bikinis and stuff and I want my abs to kind of pop out more than what they are like you can see them up here but when we get down here it's, it's giving poochy that's what it's giving so yeah let's go to the gym is bouncing bouncing stop doing it stop bouncing let me rig it up right quick see if i can stop it from doing the back here no. that ain't gonna work anyway i will share the um the link to that recipe although i didn't get to show y'all the final look of it it's basically hamburger helper it's basically what it was. It's a hamburger helper with less calories. That's all it was. Um, and it was good. Uh, I wish I would have added some different cheese. I did mozzarella and then like American cheese. But I'm a sharp cheddar cheese girly. So I wish I would have added like some little sharp cheddar in there. But I didn't. It was still good. Um, Lacey likes hamburger helper. I'm not really a fan of hamburger helper. But I made that and I made the real hamburger helper just in case they didn't like it but yeah i know y'all was looking at the screen like what the hell is she cooking and then my phone went dead so anyway hi guys it is thursday and it's around 1 40 in the afternoon um i just dropped the fun police off at the school because they have a jv track meet today so you know he's a coach so he has to be there and then alexa is working the track meet because she's a varsity and they're making the varsities help with the JV track meet which totally makes sense um and then my car is still in the shop y'all getting the dents removed we are on like day I don't know it's, it's been a couple of days since my car has been in the shop it ain't done yet um so we still just driving one vehicle so that's why I had to drop him off but I am about to go to the gym, get a workout in. Yesterday, I, I did not do a good job at, at vlogging yesterday because I told y'all let's go to the gym, but then didn't take y'all to the gym. Then I went to the grocery store again and didn't take y'all in there because I was on the phone talking about some important shit. Um, 
then I didn't finish showing y'all what I was cooking. Like, I be trying, y'all. I promise I be trying. But we are going to the gym today. It just depends on how full the gym is, if I record or not, which I might go to a different gym. Um, instead of going to Club Fitness, I might go to the rec center here um, where I live um, and get my workout in there. The only problem with that is I don't have a membership to the rec center. Um, so I have to pay like a day pass to get in, which is like $8 or something, which is kind of crazy just to work out. But since it's just me today, I guess it, it wouldn't be a big deal to just pay it's either six or eight dollars. I think it's six dollars for residents and then eight dollars for the outsiders. Um, and it should be fairly empty in there around this time. So I might I might go to the rec center, y'all. We'll see. But depending on like how packed it is in there, if I feel comfortable re recording. Because y'all know I, I'm still you know a little weird about recording in public and people looking at me crazy i'm trying to get over it but y'all know how they go oh nail update so nails are still going strong i put them back on finally um but they are going strong it's been it'll be a week tomorrow no other nails have fell off except for that thumb and like i told y'all i felt like the thumb was gonna come off anyway because of how i put it on there um so i wasn't really mad about the thumb coming off because i had already thought that it was gonna come off but no other nails had came off so far i'm actually being impatient because i'm waiting to see how long they last i'm waiting to see if i can stretch it all the way to the, to the 30 days because people saying on the ticket talk they saying that you know that glue helps your nails stay on for 30 days and i'm trying to test it to see if it will actually last for 30 days but I low-key want to try some different stuff. And this is another reason why I know it's not a good idea for me to actually get my nails done. Um, because I feel like I would want to change it up too much. So, like, once these are two weeks old, I, it's going to be hard for me to keep them on because I already done ordered some new nails, y'all. I want some, you know, a different color, something more summery. We'll see. Hopefully, they come in a decent amount of time because these actually didn't come that quick and i got these from etsy it took them a long time to ship these to me um also i need to stop off at sam's because lexi sent me a recipe for salmon so i am assuming she wants to eat salmon for dinner tonight which i'm okay with that because i you know she beat me to the punch i ain't got to ask what she want to eat i ain't got to try to figure out what she want to eat none of that so i'm just gonna go get some salmon from sam's um and then the other because i think it was like a honey some type of honey salmon or yeah i could totally have been making this up in my head it's some it's some salmon with some type of sauce on it so i gotta get the ingredients for that so that i can make her salmon she's gonna be at the track meet for quite some time today so i have time to grab that get home cook i'm also going live on tiktok today uh i want to go live and uh package some orders you know do a little chit chat uh it's kind of you know it's a little marketing just a little there's a little slight marketing um because the skincare line has been doing well so far but of course i needed to be doing a little bit better like i need to be pulling in some more sales or whatever but i i think that a lot of people still don't realize that the skincare line exists so i gotta do a better job of you know putting videos out there you know just kind of you know bringing awareness to the line so that we can get some more sales honey and then i'm still working on trying to add more stuff to the line like a face cleaner a moisturizer uh stuff like that i'm working on it it takes time so i don't i don't see it hitting the website like soon but in the near future because it just takes time to figure all of that out or whatever um so yeah that is what we're doing today guys um i will be back once i get to the gym
we are done with our workout. I was only able to record so much because it started getting a little crowded and I started getting a little uh, self-conscious that people was watching. If I had started recording, like if I had pulled out my camera and my tripod and started recording, so I'm gonna grow out of that one of these days. I need to. I already have slight social anxiety, not a lot, just just a little bit. And then trying to make me draw more attention to myself. That's what I asked for. So anyway, now I'm heading to Sam's to get some salmon. Uh, so that I can have Lexi dinner ready when she comes home. It is 318 right now. I wasn't at the gym that long. I honestly probably should have did more. Um, but today I was kind of dragging a little bit because in my, in my head I keep playing like all the other stuff I need to do today. And it's easy for me to be like, no, I got other stuff to do. I won't go to the gym. I'm trying not to do that. I'm trying to give myself at least an hour to go to the gym, get a workout in and still, you know, have a productive day. One thing that does not help me is the fact that I won't get my ass up earlier than when I'm getting up. But then again, I feel like it, it evens itself out. Even though I wake up at 10, today I woke up at 11. I normally never wake up at 11. Most of the time I wake up between nine and 10. But even though I'm waking up at nine and 10 in the morning, I'm still staying up to like two, three at the latest. Most of the time it's around two. So those times that I'm staying up past the average time that the average person stays up, I'm I'm still getting work done in those, you know, hours. So, you know, someone who wakes up earlier than me but goes to bed earlier than me, I'm probably getting the same amount of time in my day that they do. So I don't know why I beat myself up so much about not waking up super early when I literally be up all night working i'll be doing work like i'll be getting shit done so anyway let's go to sam's to get this damn salmon and get home and cook dinner so that lexi can eat when she gets home We made it out of Sam's. Y'all got some sushi because why not? The only sushi I eat is like California rolls or like, um, what's the other one? Philly rolls. Is that a thing? Am I making that up? I feel like that's a thing. I don't, I don't dibble and dabble in them. The, like the raw fish that mm -mm, y'all be doing too much sometimes. So this is just a spicy California roll. Um, and me personally, I feel like sushi is pretty healthy. Like as far as like calories and stuff, I be seeing a lot of other people that be trying not to eat sushi if they're on their diet or they work out just so they can get sushi. And it's like all sushi is is rice, fish. This one got cucumber in it, avocado, and a little sauce. I mean, the worst part about it is probably the sauce, but everything else. What's the big deal? I don't know. Maybe I just don't know what I'm talking about. Mm. Maybe it's just something I don't know. Because, of course, I was real big in fitness for a long time. But it's not like I have a degree in diet <laughs> and food. Like, So maybe it's something I'm missing. 
because in my opinion this is pretty healthy i would literally eat this every day on a diet and i'm not even telling a lie so now i'm about to head home tidy up a little bit and start cooking dinner <laughs> yesterday because it was a track meet so i had to do <coughs> the track vlog but we are it's like noon it's right at noon we're oh, oh, I got it. I thought I left my phone. we're heading to the mall we're actually heading to the mall to meet one of our um supporters from social media apparently they are from chicago and are here for a college visit. So we are gonna meet them at the mall and say hey. So we got the fun police and Lexi is back there too. So that's where we heading. I'll be back once we get to the mall. We just got to the mall. I got the clinging with me. Y'all, I don't even know. I done seen pictures, but my memory is so high. <laughs> my memory is so jacked up that I don't remember what these people look like. No, I think it'll come to me once I see them. You know how you don't know what you're looking for, but when you see it, it like come back to you. Yeah. Oh, they so do got the dolls out. Go where? Think we got time? We came in Bath and Body Works to get a little gift because her birthday is on the 17th. Oh, there she is, okay. So it was a fun piece idea. I can see my cousin. My uh, nephew just crossed over yesterday. He a new. Lacey was looking at his, uh, his little video. He's in front and everything. Yeah. He looked like he's strolling better than everybody else. Everybody else looked a little stiff. TJ looked like he been. He said, since I gotta do it, I better do it right. I'm doing it right. <laughs> Like he's been strolling for forever. We secured the gift. Now we are walk walking over to the, uh, is it closed? No, it look like they just opened from a different side. Cause they, the gate is open over there. Let's see if we can find them. Close to Kay's Jewelry. <laughs> How are you? I heard you having a birthday soon. Happy birthday. Hi. I have the camera on me. Do you mind being on camera? I am vlogging. You good? Okay. She's in shock. She's like, how you doing? You're welcome. You're welcome. So did you like the school that you visit? You like it? Good. You like St. Louis? Yeah. 
Okay. <laughs> This one's for you Baby, you my everything You all I ever wanted We could do it real big Bigger than you ever done it You be up on everything Other hoes ain't never on it I want this forever I swear I could spend whatever on it But she hold me down Every time I hit up When I get right, I promise that we gon' live it up She made me beg for it Till she gave it up And I say the same thing Every single time I said you the beauty best the best You the best It's a little bit later in the day. Um, what are we do? We have went to the mall. We got some stuff from Victoria's Secrets. Um, me and the fun police went and ate at Chili's. It was trash. Y'all, the food was I went home, did some cleaning. I needed to wipe some stuff down. I wanted to wipe the window sills and stuff down in the uh, kitchen slash, I don't know, the, the area in my kitchen where the sofa and stuff is, I don't know what to call that. Cause it's inside the kitchen. We have a living room. That ain't the living room. So like, what is, what is that? Like, what do I call that? But anyway, um, I washed the curtains in there. Vacuum. I wiped down like the area where Cairo and Bentley be at, where they cots are. I like wiped down the walls and stuff in that area. Uh, I did not, I wanted to mop. I did not mop because I realized that I left a bucket of water, of mop water from the last time I mopped with the damn mop in it still so when i took the mop out the mop stank it smelled like mildew so now i need to get a new mop so i couldn't mop the floor with that but anyway we are in walmart it is 10 30 at night we're in walmart because i got a sweet tooth i've been trying not to eat like sweets and stuff until like the weekend like i give myself a day to have like a, a sweet snack which is gonna be today today is saturday um did i tell y'all it was saturday i think i told y'all it was saturday so i think i want to make me a banana split homemade banana split or maybe a banana split blizzard at the house so that's what we're here and of course they just put grapes into the basket um so that's what we're here for now so i can get stuff to make me a banana split if i can billy get up both of them is the problem
Anyway, I'm back from the stuff. I have no idea how to make, thank you, Lex. Thank you. How to make a banana split. But I think I'm gonna make banana split blizzard instead of a banana split. I don't know, I just got, I don't know. I don't know why. Uh, y'all, I don't know if y'all can see the fact that my pants are see-through. And you can see my feet underwear. So do not point it out in the damn comments. I already know. Alright, we're gonna wing this. So I am getting ready to cut up my my fruit. And while I do that, I'm gonna put these, these my ice cream in the right just to make sure it's staying. Um, I have some pineapples, some pineapple chunks because I feel like it's some type of pineapple something something that's in the banana split. We got we got the caramel drizzle by Hershey's. We got some bananas and we got some strawberries. I don't. I guess they do have chocolate in it. I'm really not a chocolate person, so I'm just gonna do caramel. I don't know how this gonna taste. We just corn. I guess we're gonna figure it out. Let me rinse my strawberries off. So I rinse those off. I'm only gonna cut up, let's cut up like three of them. Like three big ones. That's three. I like that one better. Let's do four. We're gonna cut up four of them just in case. That week, state is this week, and then I'm out of school. And I'm gonna take my finals before I go to state, so I don't have to come back to school. Are you you doing full day next year? No, I'm doing. They still haven't done the meeting, but I'm doing a late start. Yeah, cause you was the late start queen. You've been doing good for the last week. <laughs> so through that week, y'all, Lexi stay going to school late. When I say late. I'm not talking about, oh, she's 15, 20 minutes late. No, like, mom, hours. mom, can I sleep in and she go to school hours late? Like, actually, I'll wake up, do my homework, and then go to school. Like, I wake up and start my, like, it's a normal day. <laughs> like, I got kids or something, <laughs> a normal Saturday, and I'll go to school three hours late. And then the lady at the school emails me every time and be like Lexi was late is there a reason why and we gotta make up a story sometimes she be telling me I was like I don't want to she said if you really don't or if you have a headache what's that uh, I actually thought I had a headache now I don't know my head it was hurting a little bit Cairo where are you supposed to be alright I cut up my banana I hope y'all can see. I can't see myself right now. Let me see what y'all can see. Okay, right, y'all can see a little bit. Don't see Cairo. Hmm, early. Cairo, go. Go. Get out of here. All right. I got a pineapple. Huh? I got a pineapple. It doesn't know. On top of his head? Oh, he got a pineapple. I thought you were talking about my can of pineapple. Yeah, this can is way was way more than what I needed. Mm. Okay, why is that? Hold on. Okay, here we go. Um, I shouldn't have to cut these. I'm just throwing them in there like they are. I'm draining them right quick. Take this. Let me get the blender. All right. Blender. Shit. Go. <laughs> <Girl. laughs> they coached me on a scooter. Wait for it. Ah. 
That's how they're supposed to be. <laughs> On a whole scooter. Okay, now. Before I like put my ice cream in there, let me bring y'all in closer. How close should I bring y'all? Why is she taller than her? She probably only taller because she got on heels. Yeah, I don't like that either. I'm just trying to put my heels. Yeah. Huh? What do you do the same way? Huh? What do you do the same way? Yeah. Probably so. I'm gonna just mix this up real quick. Just a little bit. Let's see how we do this. Let's go low. Why is it? What's wrong? With it? Hold on. What? Do I close this first? I legit don't know how to use it. Is it all backwards? Yeah. All right. Okay, that's about enough. Like, I wanted to have some substance to it. I don't want it to be like a smoothie or nothing. Now we are going to mix our ice cream. This one is our kind of ice cream scooper. Do we have ice cream scooper? <laughs> so we just want to use that same spin. Have y'all seen this ice cream before? It's the soft, it's the blue bunny soft. It says a new take on soft serve. It's soft. We should see how it goes, how it tastes. <laughs> what? You talking about how he land? Yeah, you can sit down. I can sit down. <coughs> Dang it, you got on the other Ah, uh, climb. Cairo, climb. Oh, this is soft, soft. Like, this is soft. This ice cream kind of hitting. It's good. Yeah, that's too much fruit. That's too much fruit. Don't take some of it out. Nobody else eating this but me. So don't say shit. How are you gonna split? I want to take some of this fruit out though. That's that's too much. That's way too much. What was I thinking? Why would I put so much in here? I guess I underestimated how much I was gonna need. Is this turn? Hey, 
Maybe I'm just gonna put some more ice cream in it. Hold up. Let me get another spoon. Well, let me wash this off. Cause that's definitely not gonna be enough. Like ice cream. But this ice cream is, is Shell's Kiss. That's still five, so damn. That's a whole half of the damn container. Like it's not a it's not a smoothie, it's a blizzard. Hmm. 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 Oh my god. It's tasting real banana split blizzard. Let me put some some corn with it. Hold up, y'all, hold up. Let me put a little, little caramel drizzle. Cairo, go. Ooh. That corn will eat too. Mm-hmm. Mm. That corn is good. Cairo, go. And then, I might put a little whipped cream on last. I'm gonna put the whipped cream on last. All right. One more little, ouch. Mm. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Is it the consistency that I want? I mean. Y'all. This is definitely a banana slip blizzard. It tastes so good. Let me give me something to put it in. Hold up. You know I got a little life for you, love. Yeah, I don't know about that, huh? No, you don't know nothing about that. <laughs> Why you be playing me like this? Why you be playing me like this? You all the time. All the time. She played me like I'm going to be hit on the old school music. harden up a little bit and I'll be right back with the final with the final results all right y'all it's been more like 45 minutes that this has been in there maybe 30 minutes and it's still I don't know if y'all can see it hold up let me get y'all a good look you see how some of it is hardened like around the edge or whatever but it's still kind of not as hard as I want it to be I'm gonna mix it a little bit. Yeah, it's not as hard. Like, okay, towards the bottom, it gets a little stiffer, but still not as stiff as I want it to be. But that's okay. We're gonna move on. Let me rinse this off. When I tell y'all this tastes just like the banana split lizard, and I don't even know if I did it right. Like, I don't know if I put it. All the stuff's supposed to go in there. So anyway, I'm gonna put some whipped cream on top. 
nothing fancy. Just a little bit. That was more than a little bit. I'm probably not gonna eat this all, y'all. But I know next time. Oh, I know next time not to make as much um fruit. And I think I think next time I won't make as much fruit and I won't blend it as much. I might blend the fruit and then put the uh, caramel in there with the fruit, blend the fruit a little bit, and then put the ice cream in there and literally blend the ice cream for a second. And you know what? Honestly, I could just put the, the fruit and the caramel in there, blend it for a second, and then just pour it in a bowl or in a cup like this, and then put the ice cream in there and just mix the ice cream with a spoon, not even having to put it in a blender. Yeah, this all good. This all good. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. So, I am about to snack on this. It's like almost midnight. I'm about to snack on this while, while I edit this video that y'all looking at right now. Because tomorrow's Sunday. And I'm trying to have this video out by noon. So I'm gonna edit it tonight. I might start editing. I might not finish editing until tomorrow morning. We'll see how I feel. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna end this video. Uh, make sure y'all check back on Wednesday because we do have a track vlog. Lacey just had a track week yesterday, so there will be a track vlog on Wednesday. And make sure you go look at, or make sure you check up. Check up. Make sure you catch up on the old weekly vlogs uh so that you know what's going on with your girl um and as always until next time